G'day, I'm Pat Callanan. There's a holy grail at the end of every four-wheel driver's journey. In Australia, we are blessed with some of the world's best four-wheel drive tracks and adventures. Cape York, the Simpson Desert, Fraser Island, the Kimberleys. These are all absolutely wonderful adventures. But once you've done all of those, there's one very long trek staring you right in the face, folks. It's called the Canning Stock Route, and they don't come any bigger or better. This is the pinnacle of Australian four-wheel drive touring. In this episode, we'll show you the basics of preparing for your very own Canning Stock Route adventure. Plus, we'll check out some of the products that not only survive, they thrive out here in the desert. And as for the track, we'll show you the wonderful things you'll encounter along the way. I'll tell you what, folks, I can't hide it. I am excited. The canning is a test of man and machine. Some would say the ultimate off-road adventure. 1,744 kilometres, almost 1,000 sand dunes, yet only one fuel stop. If this were a ski run, it would be a double black diamond job. When you finish this trek, you will become the king of every campfire conversation from here to kingdom come. So let's hit the track. The Canning Stock Route lives in the heart of Western Australia. The small settlement of Waluna is where our journey begins and we'll head north following the wells built by Alfred Canning. There's just one community on the entire Canning and that's at Well 33, Coonawarrigee. From there, it's even more wells until we reach the town of Billaluna. Then we take a short trek up to the Wolf Creek Meteorite Crater where our journey ends. <laughs> 